So here with Matt Coles reflecting on the one day campaign, you won the final iconic by Fitzgerald, man of the match. How do you look back on the white ball campaign as a whole? Um, I think we played some good cricket in the 50 over competition. Um, we had a couple of bad games, but we, we bounced back from those games and the losses in the T20s and taking it into the 50 over stuff, we actually came out on top. Um, and the Yorkshire game, I mean, what a test that was with a side pack full of internationals, three wickets for yourself and some, some lusty blows into the, the new building site. Um, what an occasion for the club, uh, obviously tinged with disappointment with the result, but what do you think it says about the club and, and the players that we can compete with a side that packed full of uh, experience and yeah, talent? I think we've, I think we've, we should have won that game really. We just started off a bit badly with the bat. Um, but to get it, get it down to the wire and a few decisions to go against us, I think was a bit of a shame. But like in regards to the support from the from the fans, it's been been excellent all season. Um, been good crowds for every game that we played at home in white ball cricket. And I think that's what we we should be grateful for them turning up as much more than anything that, um, and watching supporting us. And the one day cup campaign was a strong one as a whole. Why do you think the 50 over format suits it seems to suit us as a side a little bit more? Uh, I think there's just a bit more time, a bit more time obviously in, in the game and to set up, give yourself a chance to get in, whereas I think that's what a lot more of what our batters prefer to do, um, give themselves a bit of time to, to get, get going before really kicking on. I think that's what's stood out most um, in this competition. And a, a few more opportunities for you for your batting. We, we were 90 odd at Essex and a, and a lovely little cameo there at Yorkshire with some huge sixes. Yeah, obviously it's nice to nice to try and get your team over the line or get us to a good to a good total to compete with. And I think that's just what, what I've, I've been trying to work on is just getting but getting those um, skills down to a T and, and doing what I need to do when, when it's required. And a really competitive end to the season. We're, we're still in the hunt for the Specsavers County Championship. Obviously, we need a few wins this, this time. And obviously, your role as a strike bowler is going to be big in that. Yourself, Mitch Clayton, obviously, GC Villian has just, just joined us as well. So, what role has, has, the, has, the, has the bowling unit got in this County Championship campaign? And where do you see your, your role within that? Obviously, I'll try and lead the attack as much as I can um, in this in these last, the last few games. I think we need to try and win a couple of couple of at least of the two or three. How many? Of it's three or four left. Four left. I think we yeah we need to win at least two of them if we can. And yeah, I think we're we're in good good position leading into these games. I think we've just got to got to nail our basic skills as well as we can. And we sure we won't go too far wrong. Good. And any highlights for you from this one day series? Just looking looking back over the two tournaments, any particular highlights that stand out for you? Um, the six the six for the other week um, so obviously stands out, and then the not yeah the ninety odd early early on in the competition. I think we just got to, got to try and build on those those sorts of performances and, and hopefully try and get as many as I can. Lovely. So iconic by Fitzgerald, man of the match against Yorkshire Vikings was Matt Coles. Well done.